love never fails. I will not forget you all of my days. In every situation, you have never failed. You have done me well. You have done me well. You have done me well. Jesus, you have done me well. You have done me well. You have done me well, Jesus. You have done me well. You have done me well. You have done me well, Jesus. You have done me well. You have done me well. You have done me well, Jesus. He has done us well. He has done us well, he has done us well, Jesus. He has done us well, he has done us well, he's done us well, Jesus. You are too faithful to fail me, oh Jesus. You're too faithful to disappoint me. You've proven yourself in our lives, and we've come to realize you're too faithful to fail me. You're too faithful to fail me. Too faithful. You're too faithful to disappoint me. You've proven yourself in our lives. And I've come to realize you're too faithful to fail me. Jesus, you're too loving to leave me. You're too committed to leave us halfway. What you start, you always finish. And we've come to realize. You are too loving to leave me. Jesus, you are too committed to leave us. Oh, Jesus, you are too committed to leave us halfway. What you start, you always finish. And we've come to realize you are too loving to leave us. Amen. Oh my Jesus, Ebube, 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 DK. Oh my Jesus, Ebube, 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 DK. Hey, ah, Jesus, hey, boobie, hey, boobie, hey, boobie, DK. Hey, ah, Jesus, hey, boobie, hey, boobie, hey, boobie, DK. Hey, ah, Jesus, hey, boobie, hey, boobie, 
Somebody say, Jehovah Ife, Jehovah Ife. Say, Jehovah Ijin, Jehovah Ijin. Oga Ofe Ojin, Oga Ofe Ojin. Oga Ofe Ojin, Jehovah Ika. Somebody say, This our God is great. 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 This our God. Somebody said, This our God is great. 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 Thank you, Jesus, the owner of my soul. Alpha Omega, you are worthy to be praised. In all generation, there is no one like you. Alpha Omega, you are worthy to be praised. Thank you, Jesus, the owner of our soul. Alpha Omega, you are worthy to be praised. In all generation, there is no one like you. 
Alpha Omega, you are worthy to be praised. Thank you, Jesus, the owner of our soul. Alpha Omega, you are worthy to be praised. Your generation, you no one like you. Alpha Omega, you are worthy to be praised. Thank you, Jesus, the owner of my soul. Alpha Omega, you are worthy to be praised. In all generation, there is no one like you. Alpha Omega, worthy to be praised. Glory, glory, hallelujah. Glory, glory, praise the Lord. 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 Glory, 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 hallelujah. Glory, glory, praise the Lord. 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 My job, I love all who are. 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 O batako le rolo ye, alagbarata kule sheguni. E job a redu mwa ye ye o. My job, I love all who are. My job, I job, I love all who are. My job, I love all who are. My job, I love all who are. My job, I love all who are. O batako le rolo ye. Alagbarata kule sheguni ijoba redu mo mi ye ye o ma joba lo oluwa 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 obata ko re ro iloye alagbarata kule sheguni Ijoba redu mommy ye ye o ma joba lo holuwa have you heard what the lord has done he has destroyed the walls of satan he has given us victory that's why we sing oh say ye have you heard what the Lord has done? He has destroyed the walls of Satan. He has given us victory. That's why we sing, oh, say, yeah. Amen. Your name is higher than any of the name. Your name is us. Your name is Lord. Your
the Lord. Let us pray. In Jesus' name. Father Lord, we come before you this morning. We lift up our eyes to you. And we know that our help will come from you. Lord, as we have gathered this morning, we invite you into our midst. Your word says that your presence is always with us. Thank you, Lord, for that your presence is, uh, is with us this morning. In Jesus' name we have prayed. As we have gathered this morning to talk to our Lord, we are going to pray. We know that uh, John 3.16 says that for God so loved the world that he gave his only begotten son to come and die for us. So our first prayer point this morning, we are going to say, Father, we are going to thank him for the gift of life through the death of Jesus Christ. Father, Lord, in the mighty name of Jesus, Lord, we have come together this morning. We want to say thank you for the gift of life, life which you have given to us through the death of Jesus Christ. Lord, as a church, we say thank you. As a family, we say thank you. As individual, we say thank you. As a church, we come before you this morning and we say thank you in the mighty name of Jesus. Thank you for the gift of life. Thank you, Lord, because we are able to go to bed and we are able to wake up sun this morning. Lord, we say thank you. Lord, we appreciate you, Lord, in the mighty name of Jesus. Lord, we know that it is not by our own might, but it is you. Lord, we say thank you. Lord, we appreciate you, Lord, we give back all the glory. In Jesus' name, we are prayed. The, the scripture says in 1 John chapter 1, verse 9, that if we confess our sins, he is faithful and just to forgive us our sins and to cleanse us from all unrighteousness. So this morning we are going to pray. We are going to say, Father, I repent of my sin of disobedience and anger in the mighty name of Jesus. Lord, we have come before you this morning. We repent of our sins, of disobedience, and of anger. We repent of all these sins in the mighty name of Jesus. Lord, we come before you, we, we, we confess those, these sins. I will repent of them, Lord, in the mighty name of Jesus. Lord, the scriptures say that you are plenteous in mercy. Lord, be merciful to us. Lord, forgive us all our sins. Cleanse away all our iniquities in the mighty name of Jesus. As we have come before you this morning as a church, as we have come before you as individuals, as families, Lord. Lord, have mercy. Lord, have mercy upon us. Lord, have mercy upon us. Oh, Lord, cleanse away all our iniquities. Forgive us all our sins in the mighty name of Jesus. Lord, we say thank you. Lord, we know you have done it because you are plenteous in mercy. You have washed away all our sins. Thank you, Lord. In Jesus' name, we are prayed. Amen. We are going to continue to pray. The book of Psalm 18, verse 2 says, The Lord is my rock and my fortress. I am my deliverer, my God, my strength, in whom I will trust, my shield and the horn of my salvation, my stronghold. So, with this scripture, it shows that we cannot do anything without God. 
the scripture says that is the alpha and the omega. So without him, we are nothing. And his only begotten son came to this world to come and die for our sins. To come and wash away our sins. So we're going to pray this morning. We're going to plead the blood of Jesus over our life, over our family, over all our endeavors in the mighty name of Jesus. Lord, as a church, we come together. Lord, we plead the blood of Jesus over our lives, over our family, over our endeavors, over everything that concerns us. Lord, we plead the blood of Jesus upon us. Lord, as a church, we have come together. Oh, Lord, we plead the blood of Jesus upon our lives, upon our family, upon endeavors, upon your church, Lord, the mighty name of Jesus. Oh, Lord, wash us clean with your blood, Lord, the mighty name of Jesus. Oh, Lord, we plead the blood of Jesus. We plead the blood of Jesus on our family, or, 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 on, on the church, on the, all our endeavors, in the mighty name of Jesus. Blood of Jesus, we plead it in the mighty name of Jesus. In Jesus' name, we are prayed. Amen. Amen. In the attitude of uh, prayer, we are going to look uh, at the scripture, Philippians 4, 7. Philippians 4, 7 says, The peace of God, which surpasses all understanding, we guard our heart and mind through Christ. The peace of God is the ultimate thing. Is the ultimate. Because if we are able to feel peace within ourselves, we'll be good. So we are going to pray. We are going to talk to God to deliver us from the spirit of anger. The scripture says that anger is a destructive spirit. So we are going to pray for God to deliver us from the spirit of anger. Father Lord, we have come before you this morning. Lord, deliver us. Deliver us from the spirit of anger. Oh Lord, give us your peace as it is written in the scripture. The peace of God which surpasses all understanding. Oh Lord, give us your peace. Guide our hearts and mind in the mighty name of Jesus. Oh Lord, deliver us as an individual. Deliver us as a family from the spirit of anger in the mighty name of Jesus. Oh Lord, deliver us in the mighty name of Jesus from the spirit of anger. Oh Lord, deliver us. Deliver us as you have come before you this morning. Oh Lord, put in us your peace, Lord, in the mighty name of Jesus. Which surpasses all understanding. Give us your peace. Give us your peace in the mighty name of Jesus. Oh Lord, give us your peace in the mighty name of Jesus. So shall it be. In Jesus' name, we are prayed. Amen. We are going to look at uh, the book of Isaiah 43, verse 19. Isaiah 43, verse 19 says, See, I am doing a new thing. Now it springs up. Do you not perceive it? I am making a way in the wilderness and streams in the wasteland. From these scriptures, we're able to get that. What is, I think we need to ask ourselves, what is wilderness? Wilderness is more like a barren land where nothing grows. A wasteland is more like where there is no water. But this scripture is telling us that, that we are doing a new thing. Now it springs up, it's coming up. Do you not perceive it? I am making a way in the wilderness and streams in the wasteland, which means God is making ways for us. God is making way for us. So we're going to pray. We are going to say, Father, by the authority in the name of Jesus, we are going to command every evil force that can fall for, cause us to fail at the edge of breakthrough. We are going to paralyze all those uh, evil forces in the mighty name of Jesus. Lord, in Jesus' name, as a church, we come before you this morning. Oh, Lord, by the authority in your name, we command every evil forces that can cause us to fail at the end of breakthrough. We cause them to be paralyzed in the mighty name of Jesus. Every evil forces that can hold us back, that can delay, derail us, Lord. 
we cause them to paralyze now in the mighty name of Jesus. Every evil force that can hinder us, every evil force that can be a blocker, that can be an impediment to our, to, to, to our prosperity, we cause them to paralyze now in the mighty name of Jesus. Be paralyzed now in the mighty name of Jesus. By the authority in the, in the mighty name of Jesus, we, cause, we command every evil forces that can cause us to, to fail at the end, at the edge of breakthrough, to be paralyzed now in the mighty name of Jesus. Be paralyzed all the evil forces, every evil forces that can cause us to, to miss our way, we cause them to be paralyzed now in the mighty name of Jesus. In Jesus' name, we are prayed. Amen. Proverbs 19.11 Proverbs 19.11 says, a person's, a person's wisdom yield patience. It is to one's glory to overlook offense. Hmm. This scripture is, is loaded. It's very deep. Let me read it once again. A person's wisdom yield patience. It is to one's glory to overlook offense. 1911. So we're going to pray. We're going to say, Father, Father let every provocation that will cause me to fail at the edge of my success be cut off in the mighty name of Jesus. Oh Lord, let every provocation that can cause us to fail at the edge of our success be cut off in the mighty name of Jesus. Oh Lord, every provocation that can cause your church, that can cause us as a family, that can cause us as individuals to fail at the edge of success, be cut off now in the mighty name of Jesus. Be cut off now in the mighty name of Jesus. Be cut off now in the mighty name of Jesus. So shall it be. In Jesus' name we are prayed. Amen. Psalm 27 verse 2. Psalm 27 verse 2 says, When the wicked advance against me to devour me, it is my enemy and my foes who will stumble and fall. Let me read one, one more time. Psalm 27 verse 2. When the wicked advance against me to devour me, it is my enemies and my foes who will stumble and fall. So we're going to pray. We're going to say, Father, frustrate and disappoint every enemy of my success in the mighty name of Jesus. Oh Lord, we have come before you this morning. Oh Lord, as a church, as individual, oh Lord, frustrate and disappoint every enemy of my success in the mighty name of Jesus. Oh Lord, frustrate every enemy, enemy of our success. Frustrate every enemy of our progress. Oh Lord, frustrate every enemy of our upliftment in the mighty name of Jesus. Oh Lord, frustrate and disappoint them all now in the mighty name of Jesus. Every enemy of our success, every enemy of my breakthrough, every enemy of my upliftment, or every enemy of my blessings. Oh Lord, frustrate and disappoint them all now in the mighty name of Jesus. Disappoint them now and frustrate them now in the mighty name of Jesus. So shall it be. In Jesus' name, we are prayed. Amen. Proverbs 16, verse 9. Proverbs 16, verse 9 says, In their, in, in their hearts, humans plans their cause, but the Lord establish their steps. Mm. In the arts of in their arts, humans plan their cause, but the Lord establish their step. So, which means most times when we plan, but it is God that we hold our step to the, on the right path. So we're going to pray. We're going to say, Father, give me the grace to be at the right place at the right time in the mighty name of Jesus. Oh, Lord, as a church, give us the grace to be at the right place at the right time in the mighty name of Jesus. Oh, Lord, as a church, as a family, as an individual, oh, Lord, give us the grace to be at the right place at the right time in the mighty name of Jesus. Oh, Lord, the grace to be at the right place at the right time. Give it to us in the mighty name of Jesus. Oh, Lord, the grace to be at the right place at the right time. Give it to your church. Give it to your children. Give it to us. Give it wherever we go. Give it to us in the mighty name of Jesus. The grace to be at the right place 
at the right time. Oh Lord, give it to us. Father Lord, give it to us. The grace to be at the right place at the right time. So that we will not miss our blessings, the mighty name of Jesus. We will not miss our promotions. We will not miss our upliftments. We will not miss our blessings. We will not miss our, our, our success, the mighty name of Jesus. The grace to be at the right place at the right time, give it to us in the mighty name of Jesus. In Jesus' name, we have prayed. Amen. Ecclesi Ecclesiastic chapter 10, verse 8. Ecclesiastic 10, verse 8 says, Whoever digs a pit will fall in it. Whoever breaks through a wall will be beaten by a snake. So we're going to say, Father, let my enemy be caught by their own net that they have set for me and fall into the pit of failure that they have dug for me. Let's turn that into prayer. Father, let my enemy be caught by their own net that they have set for me. And let them fall in the, in the pit of failure which they have dug for me. Oh Lord, let my enemy be, be, be caught by their own net, in the mighty name of Jesus. Let them fall by their, in their own pit, Lord, in the mighty name of Jesus. As a church, as a family, uh, we have come together this morning. Oh Lord, your, your word says that whoever digs a pit will fall in it by himself. Oh Lord, let my enemy, let them be caught by their own net. Oh Lord, let them fall in the pit which they have dug for me. Let them fall in it by themselves, Lord, in the name of Jesus. Oh Lord, let my enemy be caught by their own net, in the name of Jesus. Oh Lord, let your presence always be with me. Oh Lord, direct me, order my steps, Lord, in the name of Jesus, so that I will be at the right place at the right time. Oh Lord, the plans of enemy against me, against your church, against me, against me individually, against my family, against my endeavors. Oh Lord, come and frustrate it now in the name of Jesus. Any net they have set for me, let, it be, let them be caught by their own nets. Let them fall in the, into their own pit which they have dug for me in the mighty name of Jesus. In Jesus' name, we have prayed. In Jesus' name, we have prayed. We are going to pray. We are going to say, Father, as your wind blows, I receive the anointing to finish well and finish strong in the mighty name of Jesus. Oh Lord, as a church, as your wind blows, we receive the anointing to finish well and finish strong in the mighty name of Jesus. Oh Lord, as a church, as a family, as individual, oh Lord, as your wind blows, Oh Lord, we receive the anointing to finish well and finish strong in the mighty name of Jesus. Oh Lord, the anointing to finish well, the anointing to finish strong. Oh Lord, put it on me in the mighty name of Jesus. Put, put it on your church, Lord, in the name of Jesus. Oh Lord, put it on your children, Lord, in the name of Jesus. The anointing to finish well, the anointing to finish strong, Lord, in the name of Jesus. Oh Lord, give it to us in the mighty name of Jesus. Oh Lord, give it to us in the mighty name of Jesus. The anointing to finish strong, the anointing to finish well. Oh Lord, give it to us in the mighty name of Jesus. Oh Lord, give it to us in the mighty name of Jesus. Your word said that whatever we ask in your name, you will give to us. Oh Lord, the anointing to finish well, the anointing to finish strong. Oh Lord, give it to us. In Jesus' name, we are prayed. Amen. Amen. We are going to continue to pray. We are going to say, Father, as your wind is blowing, I command every wall of Jericho before me to be demolished in the mighty name of Jesus. Every wall of Jericho before me be demolished in the mighty name of Jesus. The wall of Jericho, they are obstacles. They are blockers. They are impediments that will prevent you from getting to the promised land. They, they are obstacles that will prevent you from getting to where your success is. Let us command them to be pulled down now in the mighty name of Jesus. Oh Lord, we command every wall of Jericho before me to be demolished in the mighty name of Jesus. And oh Lord, every wall of Jericho against your church, against us as a family, against us as individuals, be demolished now in the mighty name of Jesus. Every wall of Jericho before me be demolished. Every wall of Jericho around me be demolished. Every wall of Jericho before my family be demolished. Every wall of Jericho before your church be demolished. Every wall of 
Jericho against my children be demolished. Every wall of Jericho against my endeavors, against, against my success, against my promotion, against my blessings be demolished now in the mighty name of Jesus. Every wall of Jericho around me, every wall of Jericho before me, be demolished in the mighty name of Jesus. Be demolished now in the mighty name of Jesus. In Jesus' name, we are prayed. Amen. Amen. Romans 8, verse 37. Romans 8, 37 says, No, in all these things, we are more than conquerors through him who loved us. Through him who loved us. We are more than con conquerors through Jesus Christ. So we're going to pray. Father, Father I, shall I shall succeed. Nothing shall pull me down in the mighty name of Jesus. Let's turn into prayer. Father, I shall succeed in all my endeavors. Nothing shall pull me down. Oh, Lord, your church shall succeed in the mighty name of Jesus. Every hindrance is upon your church, in front of your church, be demolished now. Oh, Lord, I shall succeed as an individual. I shall succeed as an individual. Oh, Lord, nothing will pull me down, mighty name of Jesus. Oh, Lord, my family shall succeed, mighty name of Jesus. Nothing, nothing will pull my family down, mighty name of Jesus. Oh, Lord, as a family, as an individual, oh, Lord, my children will succeed. Nothing will pull them down, mighty name of Jesus. Oh, Lord, I shall succeed in all my endeavors. Nothing shall pull me down, mighty name of Jesus. Oh, Lord, your church shall succeed. Nothing shall pull your church down, mighty name of Jesus. Oh, Lord, your children shall succeed. Nothing shall pull us down, mighty name of Jesus. Oh, Lord, we look up to you, the power, the grace to succeed. Oh, Lord, give it to us, Lord, mighty name of Jesus. Oh, Lord, I shall succeed. Nothing shall pull me down, mighty name of Jesus. Oh, Lord, I shall be unstoppable, unstoppable in the mighty name of Jesus. Eternal rock of ages, you will be behind us to support us in the mighty name of Jesus. You will be in us to strengthen us. You will be above us to lift us up. Lord, in the mighty name of Jesus, oh, Lord, I shall succeed. Your church shall succeed. Your children shall succeed. Nothing shall pull us down in the mighty name of Jesus. In Jesus' name, we are prayed. Amen. Ephesians chapter 6, verse 11. Ephesians 6, 11 says, Put on the full armor of God so that you can take your stand against the devil's scheme. Put on the full armor, not, not part of the armor, the full armor of God so that you can take your stand against the devil's scheme. This, the scripture says the devil is here to kill and destroy. But our Lord has come to give us life and to give us abundantly. So we're going to pray. We're going to say, Father, I refuse to be a tool in the hand of the devil. Let's turn into prayer. Oh, Lord, as, as your church have gathered before you this morning, Lord, we look up to you. Oh, Lord, we refuse to be a tool in the hand of the devil. Oh, Lord, my children refuse to be a tool in the hand, in the hand of the devil. Oh, Lord, I, I refuse to be a tool in the hand of the devil. Oh, Lord, your children refuse to be a tool in the hand of the devil. Oh, Lord, as we have come together this morning, oh, Lord, we refuse to be a tool in the hand of the devil. We refuse to be a tool in the hand of the devil. We refuse to be a tool in the, hand of the, in the hands of the devil. As your church refused to be a tool in the hand of the devil. Oh, Lord, be, your, your, the scripture says, your word and their light unto our path. Oh, Lord, direct us. Oh, Lord, give us wisdom. Open our eyes of understanding. Oh Lord, we refuse to be a tool in the hands of the devil. We refuse to be a tool in the hands of the devil. As a church, we refuse to be a tool in the hands of the devil. As individuals, we refuse to be a tool in the hands of the devil. In Jesus' name, we are prayed. Amen. Amen. We are going to pray. We are going to say, Father, 
as you help, as you have helped Peter to overcome failure at the edge of success. Help me to overcome in the mighty name of Jesus. Oh Lord, help me to overcome. Oh Lord, as we have come together before you this morning, as a church, as a family, as an individual, oh Lord, help me. The same way you have helped Peter to overcome failure at the edge of success. Oh Lord, help me to overcome. Help me to overcome. Oh Lord, help me to overcome failure in the mighty name of Jesus. I shall succeed. Oh Lord, I shall succeed in the mighty name of Jesus. I shall prosper in the mighty name of Jesus. Your church shall succeed. Your children shall succeed. My family shall succeed. My children shall succeed. Oh Lord, by your power I shall succeed. I shall prosper in the mighty name of Jesus. Oh Lord, thou will perfect everything that concerns me. You will perfect everything that concerns your church. You will perfect everything that concerns my family that concerns me. Oh Lord, you are the God of perfection. You will perfect everything that concerns me. I shall succeed in the mighty name of Jesus. Jesus. Oh Lord, oh Lord, help me to, to overcome failure at the edge of success. Oh Lord, help me your child to overcome failure at the, at the edge of success. Oh Lord, help me to overcome, help me to overcome any, every orders of life, every impediments of life, every blockers of life. Oh Lord, help me to overcome in the mighty name of Jesus. In Jesus' name, we are prayed. Amen. Amen. We are going to pray. I'm going to say, Father, as your wind is blowing, break every cause of failure at the edge of success in my life. Every, every cause of failure, break them. Break every, every cause of failure at the edge of success in my life. Anything that can cause me to fail at the edge of success, oh Lord, demolish them. Break them in the mighty name of Jesus. Oh Lord, as, you, as we have come before you this morning, oh Lord, every cause of failure upon my life, every cause of failure upon the life of my children, every cause of failure in my family, every cause of failure upon your church, oh Lord, break them now in the name of Jesus. Every cause of failure at the edge of success in my life, oh Lord, I break them now in the name of Jesus. I command them now in the name of Jesus. I paralyze them and I break them now in the mighty name of Jesus. I break them now in the mighty name of Jesus. In Jesus' name, we are prayed. Father, Lord, we thank you. We appreciate you. Lord, we give back all the glory. Lord, we thank you because you've answered our prayer. Oh, Lord, we have faith. Your word says that even if our faith is as small as a mustard seed, that we can move mountains. Lord, we have come together this morning to put before you our prayers. Lord, we know that you've answered our prayer. We just want to say thank you. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord. In Jesus' name, we have prayed. Amen. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. As we continue in the program, we will continue in the name of the Lord. I just want us to take a few songs, a few worship songs as we go into the as we continue in the presence of God. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. You are God from, from beginning, beginning to the end. There is no place for arguments. You are God all by yourself, by yourself. You are God from beginning to the end. There is no place for arguments. You are God all by yourself. How excellent is your name, O Lord. How excellent, how excellent is your name, O How excellent is your name, 
Au excellentis Yoni. Yoni. Au excellentis Yoni. O Lord, how excellent, how excellent is your name. How excellent is your name. How excellent is your name. O Lord, praise the Lord. Hallelujah. Praise the name of the Lord. Brethren, we are fortunate to be doing this again. It is the grace of God that we are alive up to this moment. As we continue to be in the presence of God, i like us to go before God. First, to appreciate him, to appreciate this God. I don't think there is anybody here that can say he or she is who he or she is by his power. We know we are where we are what we have by the special grace of God. I want us to go before God in a way we have never before to say thank you. To say thank you. I want us to come into his presence with a sacrifice of thanksgiving according to his word in Psalm 50 verse 14, O oh Lord. Father, we have come this morning, O oh Lord, with a sacrifice of genuine thanksgiving, O oh Lord, for that which you have done for us that we cannot even comprehend. Father, we just want to say thank you. Father, we thank you for the gift of life, O oh Lord. We thank you for sleeping and waking up, O oh Lord. We thank you for a date like this, O oh Lord, that you have set this program, O oh Lord. And we have come to the final day. Father, we thank you. We thank you for testimonies that are abound. We thank you, O oh Lord, for deliverances, O oh Lord. We thank you for the healings that have been taking place as a result of this program. Father, we thank you. We thank you for our families, O oh Lord. We thank you even for this nation. We thank you, O oh Lord, even for the world at large. Father, we thank you, O oh Lord, for going out and coming in. We thank you, brethren. Throughout this week, I have seen accidents and accidents and accidents and accidents. But God has remained faithful in protection, O oh Lord. He did not leave any one of us to accidents. I just want us to thank this God, to thank this God wonderfully, O oh Lord, in the name of Jesus. I want us to thank this God with a heart of gratitude because we cannot do all these things by ourselves. Father, we thank you. We thank you with all that you have blessed us with. Father, we return all to you, O oh Lord. We thank you, O oh Lord. We do not take anyone for granted. Any of those things you have done for us, Father, we do not take them for granted. We thank you for having singled us out for your protection, for your provision. For having singled us out for your salvation, Father, we thank you. We give you all the glory, O oh Lord. We give you all the honor. We adore you at a time like this, O oh Lord. Glory, 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 and honor be unto your holy name. For in Jesus' mighty name we have prayed. We are going to continue. Today is the second to the last day of March. The year is going up. The year is rolling. It's rolling. April is coming. We are in the period of restoration. We are going to thank God for what he did for us in the month of January. The Lord saw us through. The Lord guided us. The Lord was there for us. We are going to thank God. Even for February, Father, we thank you. We bless your holy name. Even for the month of February, you did not allow us to cry. You did not allow us to wander away. You remain our shepherd. You gave us instruction and you gave us the mind to follow your instruction and we are behind you. Father, we thank you. Father, we bless your holy name for the month of March, O oh Lord, that has come to an end tomorrow. Father, we thank you. We bless your holy name. For the month of April going forward, Father, we give you all the glory, O oh Lord. We know you'll be there with us all through the way, O oh Lord. All through the waters, you know you'll be there with us. You know you, we know you will settle all the storms in our life, O oh Lord. Moving forward in the name of Jesus. Father, we thank you, O oh Lord. For the month of May, June, July, and going forward, O oh Lord, Father, you know, we know you'll be sufficient for us, O oh Lord. We know you'll be so. We just want to say thank you in advance, O oh Lord. Thank you, thank you, thank you, Lord. For in Jesus' mighty name, we have prayed. Brethren, if we say we have no sin, we lie. 
we all have fallen short of God's glory. We lie. So I want us to remain in the presence of God and ask for his forgiveness. Even up to this morning, many of us would have said things, insinuated things that is against the law of God. I just want us to come with a heart of forgiveness, O oh Lord. Father, I ask you, O oh Lord, I ask that you forgive us our sins, O oh Lord, our trespasses in the mighty name. Father, forgive us, O oh Lord, in the mighty name of Jesus, according to your word in First John chapter 1, verse 9. If we confess, if only we confess our sins, our God, our true God, is able, is willing to forgive and cleanse us of all trespass. I just want us to ask for genuine forgiveness this morning in the name of Jesus. Father, I ask you, O oh Lord, whatever it is that we have done as an individual, as a church, as a family, as a group, Father, we ask that you forgive us, O oh Lord. Forgive us our sins, O oh Lord. Sins that we committed unknowingly, sins that we committed deliberately, Father, forgive us, O oh Lord. In the mighty name of wash us pure with the blood of Jesus, O oh Lord. Father, have mercy, O oh Lord. Have mercy, O oh Lord. Have mercy upon us, O oh Lord. Give us a spirit willing enough to abstain from sin, to withstand temptation in the mighty name of Jesus. As many a times our soul, our spirits are willing, Father, make our flesh willing, O oh Lord, to abide by your word in the mighty name of Jesus. For in Jesus' mighty name we have prayed. Brethren, we are going to be praying for healing this morning. We are going to concentrate ourselves on healing and deliverance in this, in this part of the program. And we are going to say, Father, bless me. Bless my soul for healing of all diseases in the name of Jesus. Brethren, whether we like it or not, so many diseases that we do not even understand, cannot even comprehend, that are here and dear. We are going to ask that God should heal us. That God should heal us. It's perfect healing. Little wonders, the doctors will say, we only treat. It is only God that heals. No matter what it is we are going through, let us ask for God's healing. This morning, in the name of Jesus, Father Lord, we ask for your healing your permanent and perfect healing, O oh Lord, upon every part of our body in the name of Jesus. Father, we ask, O oh Lord, that you will heal us in our eyes, O oh Lord, heal us. Father, you will heal us in our speech and every process of our speaking. Father, heal us in the name of Jesus. Father, help us, O oh Lord, even in our lungs, O oh Lord, we ask you to heal us, O oh Lord, in the mighty name of Jesus. Father, heal us completely as a body. Father, heal us. And let us be healthy bodily in the mighty name of Jesus. For in Jesus' mighty name, we have prayed. We are going to say, Lord, send healing to our soul and body now in the name of Jesus. Father, we ask, O oh Lord, even consigning all our organs, O oh Lord, Father, let there be healing in the mighty name of Jesus. Let there be healing. In the mighty name of Jesus, consigning our lungs, O Lord. Father, anyone that is having any form of deformity, O Lord, Father, replace and replenish in the name of Jesus. Spiritually, O Lord, replace and replenish in the mighty name of Jesus. Is there anyone going through any kidney process, O Lord? Any form of kidney problem, O Lord? Father, let there be replacements in the mighty name of Jesus. Let there be re 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 repair. In the mighty name of Jesus. For in Jesus' mighty name we have prayed. We are going to say, Lord, deliver us from the cause of sickness and ailments in the mighty name of Jesus. Brethren, I like us to pray. I like us to pray and I ask for the deliverance from every cause of sickness. Sickness is not what, what makes anybody happy. Sickness makes one sit down. Sickness makes one stagnant. We are going to pray against this sickness, any form of sickness, anything that will make us stagnant in the mighty name of Jesus. Father, Lord, in heaven we pray, O oh Lord, that you deliver us, O oh Lord. We call on you, O oh Lord, to deliver us in the mighty name of Jesus from every cause of sickness, from every cause of sickness upon our life, from every cause of sickness. Deliver us from every form of ailments, O oh Lord, from any form of disease in the mighty name of Jesus. Make our whole body, O oh Lord, to be perfect, O oh Lord, for your glory in the mighty name of Jesus. For in Jesus' mighty name we have prayed. We are going to say, Father, 
give us immunity against strange diseases and sicknesses in the name of Jesus. Father, in the mighty name of Jesus, we pray, O oh Lord, that you make us free. You make us far from every form of strange diseases, O oh Lord. Things that the doctor will say, I'm sorry there is no cure for it now. Father, keep us safe from it, O oh Lord. Keep us free from it, O oh Lord, in the mighty name of Jesus. Any form of sickness, O oh Lord, that will weigh us down, O oh Lord. Father, we come against it in the mighty name of Jesus. We present ourselves to you, O oh Lord, this morning, O oh Lord, as a holy body, O oh Lord. Father, sustain us, O oh Lord. Keep us, O oh Lord, in the mighty name of Jesus. For adventure, there is anyone going through any form of medication right now, O oh Lord. Father, such medication will work for their repair in the mighty name of Jesus. Father, they will not take it and continue to take it and continue to take it. There will be an end to it in the mighty name of Jesus. As a result of the permanent healing, you will lay upon them in the mighty name of Jesus. For in Jesus' mighty name we have prayed. We are going to say, Arise. Send back to sender, O Lord, arrows of sickness shot into our body system in the mighty name of Jesus. In Africa, they used to say they send offer. Father, return it back to sender in the mighty name of Jesus. Everyone that has dug one pit or the other, O Lord, for us, Father, may they feel it themselves in the name of Jesus. Father, we want to pray, O Lord, that every evil plan, O Lord, everyone that has set one trap, or the other. Father, may they fall into it in the mighty name of Jesus. For in Jesus' mighty name, we have prayed. We are going to pray again, and we are going to say, for every pit that has been dug for us, O Lord, for every form of six feet that has been dug for us, O Lord, whoever dig it will replace us in Jesus' name, in the mighty name of Jesus. Father, we ask, O Lord, this morning, that you will fight all our battles, in the mighty name of Jesus. Fight my battle, fight my battle. Holy Ghost, arise, oh, and fight my battle. Fight my battle, fight my battle. Holy Ghost, arise, oh, and fight my battle. Fight my battle, fight my battle. Holy Ghost, arise, oh, and fight my battle. Praise the Lord. We are going to say, Father, restore all monies. Not one. All monies, times, and virtues we have lost to sickness and disease in the name of Jesus. Father, in the mighty name of Jesus, every form of funds, every form of time that we may have spent in the course of recovery, O oh Lord, in the course of any sickness, O oh Lord, Father, replenish in the name of Jesus. Father, replenish, O oh Lord, in the name of Jesus. Restore at a time of restoration, O Lord. Father, restore back unto us in the name of Jesus. Everything we have spent, every form of energy we may have lost, every form of stature we may have lost, Father, restore back to us in Jesus' name. For in Jesus' mighty name, we have prayed. We are going to pray again. And we are going to say, whatever, whatever is synonymous to trouble, Jehovah, deliver us in the mighty name of Jesus. Deliver us, whatever, O oh Lord, that is standing, that is as a form of trouble in front of us, O oh Lord. Father, deliver us from it in the name of Jesus. Deliver us, O oh Lord. Even our family members, both far and near, Father, deliver them, O oh Lord, in the mighty name of Brethren, as we pray, let us remember our family members. At a time like this, everybody needs prayer, but not everybody can pray. Not everybody have the opportunity to be in a place like this. So let us remember them, both far and near, both young and old. Let us remember them in the mighty name of Jesus. Father, anything that is a form of sickness, a form of disappointment, a form of problem, Father, in the mighty name of Jesus, clear them away, O Lord, in the mighty name of Jesus. For in Jesus' mighty name, we have prayed. I want us to read Jeremiah chapter 17, verse 14. I want us to read one or two things in the Word of God. Whoever is there. Jeremiah. Jeremiah 17, verses 14. It's talking about him. Oh, Lord. 
If you heal me, I will be truly healed. If you save me, I will be truly saved. My praises are for you alone. Imagine the word. Father, we are going to call on God. This is a promise we are making to God. That if God should heal us, if God should save us, we will praise him and him alone in the mighty name of Jesus. So we are going to call on us, God, come and heal us. Heal us of those things that we cannot even mention. Heal us from those things that we sit in a closet and cry unto you. Father, heal us in the mighty name of Jesus. Lack of finance is a sickness. Lack of mental stability is a sickness. Anything that does not give us happiness is a sickness. Father, come and heal us. Come and heal us in the mighty name of Jesus. You alone we rely on. Even the doctors, many a times they fail. All the time they rely on you. Father, we are here to call on you. Come and heal us, O oh Lord. Come and heal us in the mighty name of Jesus. For in Jesus' mighty name we have prayed. We are going to pray and continue. And we are going to say every yoke of bondage and delay inherited from my bloodline break now by fire in the mighty name of Jesus. Many of us, we inherit causes. We inherit so many diseases. They say it's, they say it's hereditary. Today, in the mighty name of Jesus, Father, break them in the mighty name of Jesus. Break them, O oh Lord, in the, every generational cause, generational sickness, O oh Lord. Father, we break ourselves from them in the mighty name of Jesus. We declare, O oh Lord God in heaven, that we are free from it in the mighty name of Jesus. From every form of sickness, from every form of generational cause, things that we do not know of, Father, we break them, O oh Lord, in the mighty name of Jesus. And we decree concerning our children, O oh Lord, that none of them will inherit any form of generational cause in the mighty name of Jesus. For in Jesus' mighty name we have prayed. We are going to pray. Thou wasters of destiny and glory, you are a liar. Be wasted. Be wasted in the mighty name of Jesus. Every wasters of destiny and glory, we decree and we declare tonight, this morning, that may they be wasted in the mighty name of Jesus. Everyone that is planning to waste, O oh Lord, every of our resources, O oh Lord, every of God's glory upon our life, in the mighty name of Jesus, Father, we break loose from them in the mighty name of Jesus. Many times we move with people and we think they are doing us good, but they are just helping us waste our time. Father, reveal to us, O oh Lord, and break us free from them in the mighty name of Jesus. We declare freedom from such people, from such activities, in the mighty name of Jesus. For in Jesus' mighty name, we have prayed. We are going to pray. Father, as the year is running to an end, whether we like it or not, even though we are less than half of the year, it is running to an end. Father, as the year is running to an end, deliver us from the horrible pit of life in the mighty name of Jesus. By the special grace of God, we will all be complete in 2025 in the mighty name of Jesus. Father, we are, go we are praying, O oh Lord, this morning, and we are asking of you, O oh Lord, that you keep us fit and healthy all through this year in the mighty name of Jesus. That going forward, O oh Lord, in the mighty name of Jesus, you will deliver us. You will deliver us. When we travel by air, Father, you will go with us in the name of Jesus. When we travel by land, Father, you'll be there with us in the name of... Even on the sea, O oh Lord, Father, you'll be there with us in the name of Jesus. As we journey through the remaining parts of this year, Father, step by step, you will lead us. As our shepherd, O oh Lord, you will lead us in the mighty name of Jesus. Father, we pray, O oh Lord, and we commit the remaining part of this year. Financially, you will upgrade us in the mighty name of Jesus. Father, mentally, O oh Lord, you will stable us in the mighty name of Jesus. In our bones, O oh Lord, as we grow older, we will be stronger in the mighty name of Jesus. In our blood, O oh Lord, it shall be purer in the mighty name of Jesus. Every of our sense organs, O oh Lord, Father, they will, work, they will perform functionally in the mighty name of Jesus. Every of our organs, O oh Lord, 
Father, they will perform, O Lord, accordingly in the mighty name of Jesus. Father, as we go in the year, O Lord, you will meet us at the point of our needs, O Lord, in the mighty name of Jesus. Those that are seeking for any form of change in their life, O Lord, Father, you will help them, O Lord, in the mighty name of Jesus. We pray, O Lord, and we commit everyone, O Lord, that is of marriageable age. Father, you will be there with them, O Lord. You will direct them, O Lord, in the mighty name of Jesus. For in Jesus' mighty name, we have prayed. We are going to say, Father, deliver new wine family from the snare of the fowler and from every noisome pestilence in the mighty name of Father, deliver us, O Lord. As a member of this church, O Lord, new wine assembly, Father, deliver us from every snare, from every plan of the enemy, from every desire of the enemy against our life, Father, deliver us, O Lord. As a member of this church, O oh Lord, help us to stand out, O oh Lord, from the crowd as your ambassador in the mighty name of Jesus. As a member of this church, O oh Lord, Father, anoint us for greatness, O oh Lord, in the mighty name of Jesus. Father, as a member of this church, O oh Lord, help us to have representatives, O oh Lord, that we dine and wine with kings, O oh Lord, with kings. Prince, O oh Lord, in the mighty name of Jesus, as a member of this church, O oh Lord, help us to be victorious, O oh Lord, in the mighty name of Jesus. In everything that we aspire, O oh Lord, Father, help us to achieve success in the mighty name of Jesus. As a member of this church, O oh Lord, we know we are blessed in the mighty name of Jesus. For in Jesus' mighty name, we have prayed. We are going to say, O oh Lord, Father, deliver us from household enemies and from them that are stronger than us. Two prayer points. From household enemies, Father, deliver us. Those that whine and dine with us, yet they stab us behind. Father, deliver us. Deliver us, O oh Lord, in the mighty name of Jesus. From everyone, O oh Lord, that comes in front of us and smile and goes behind us and does the opposite. Father, deliver us. Father, deliver us. Father, deliver us. Those that are watching us, those that are observing us, waiting for us to succeed and then try to cut our success. Father, deliver us from them in the mighty name of Jesus. For in Jesus' mighty name we have prayed. We are going to pray that God will deliver us from those that are stronger than us. Those that are stronger than us, the evil ones. The evil ones that set arrow against us. Father, deliver us from them in the mighty name of Jesus. Father, deliver us, O Lord. In the, those that set pits, those that set evil for us. Father, deliver us from them in the mighty name of Jesus. From every plan, O Lord. From every of their antics, O Lord. Father, deliver us in the mighty name of Jesus. For in Jesus' mighty name, we are praying. We are going to pray. Father, deliver your church from enemies of the gospel in Jesus' name. Father, deliver us. Many, 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 many things going on on social media now. So many people conf confusing the world right now, and yes, they are followers. But for us, oh Lord, Father, you will deliver us. You will deliver us from such gospel in the mighty name of Jesus. From every gospel that is not according to your word, oh Lord, that is not according to your command, O oh Lord, that is not in your book, O oh Lord, Father, deliver us in the mighty name of Jesus. Deliver us, O oh Lord, in the mighty name of Jesus. For in Jesus' mighty name, we have prayed. We are going to thank the Lord for healing and deliverance. We are going to thank God for healing and deliverance. We are going to thank God because we believe that even since on Thursday, that testimonies abound. In the mighty name of Jesus. Let us go ahead and thank God, O oh Lord, for his healing. For he is the perfect healer. For he is the perfect healer. For he is our comforter. Let us go ahead and thank God for being our comforter. For being a faithful God. Father, you are faithful. You are, fa you are a sovereign God. You alone is everywhere. Father, we thank you for a time like this. We bless your holy name. Because you are the omnipresence God. You are present everywhere. You are the self-sufficient. You are present. You are sufficient. You are more than enough, oh Lord. Father, we thank you. We bless your holy name because you are a holy God. We thank you for the opportunity that we have to serve a holy God. Father, we thank you because you are Jehovah Shalom, oh Lord. We thank you because you are Jehovah Nisi, you are Jehovah El Shaddai. Father, we thank you because you are a wise God. 
Because you are a God that is stronger than the strongest, O oh Lord. Because you are a God that is richer, much more richer than the richest in the mighty. Father, we thank you because you are a God that never fails. You are a God that never changes. Father, we thank you because in you we rely on. In you we trust, O oh Lord. In you we live. Father, we thank you, O oh Lord, because you made us even the leader of every of your creatures, O oh Lord. Father, we thank you because you have created us, even in your own image, how wonderful you are. Father, we thank you because you are even the only quantifier, O oh Lord, the perfect judge. Father, we worship you this time. Father, we thank you because you are the God that never disappoints. Father, when we call on you, you answer us, O Lord. Even your silence is an answer to us. Father, we thank you. We bless your holy name. For, the, for, uh, and as for a group like this, O Lord, Father, we thank you. We thank you for locating us here, O Lord. At this location, Father, we bless your holy name. For being a blessing unto others also, Father, we thank you. We bless you. We give you all the glory, O Lord. We thank you, O Lord, that even the healing and deliverance, O Lord, shall be permanent in our life in the name of Jesus. That as we go forward, O Lord, those things you have healed us from, those things you have delivered us from, shall never return to our life in the name of Jesus. As we use ourselves, O Lord, as a point of contact, O Lord, to every member of this church, present here and elsewhere, Father, may your healing also be extended to them in the name of Jesus. May your deliverance also be extended to them in the name of Jesus. Father, we just want to say thank you. We just want to say thank you for you are a perfect God. Father, because you gave us this time to be here, O oh Lord. We set a date like this, O oh Lord, and we are all alive to witness it, to partake, O oh Lord, even in it in the mighty name of Jesus. Father, we just want to say thank you. Thanks, thanks, we give you thanks for all you have done. We are so blessed, our soul has found rest, praise God. We give you thanks, we give you thanks, 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 we give you thanks for all you have done. We are so blessed. Our soul has found rest, praise God, we give you thanks. And so our Father in heaven, we thank you for a time like this. We thank you for a good time spent in your presence. Father, we thank you because you know why you brought us here. Father, we thank you because we, we have honored your word, O oh Lord, to come and pray unto you. Father, because your word says pray without ceasing, we thank you, O oh Lord, for obeying you. Father, we give you all the glory, O oh Lord, in the mighty name of Jesus. Father, we thank you because we know that all you have done in our life, all the healing and deliverance shall be permanent in the name of Jesus. We thank you even for the leadership of this church, RCCG New Wine Assembly. Father, we thank you for keeping us in one fold, O oh Lord. We thank you for not letting us scatter in the name of Jesus. We thank you for your anointing. We thank you for deliverance, O oh Lord. For all the ministers, O oh Lord, of this church, Father, continue to uphold them, O oh Lord. For their families, continue to uphold them, O oh Lord. Father, we pray for the need of the church, O oh Lord. Father, provide for us in the mighty name of Jesus. Father, provide for us in the mighty name of Jesus. At a time like this, Father, restore to us all we have lost, O oh Lord, in the mighty name of Jesus. And as we continue in this program, O oh Lord, let all the glory be unto you, O oh Lord. For in Jesus' mighty name, we have prayed. Amen. Praise the Lord. Amen. Let's be in the attitude of worship. Let's bless the name of the Lord for yet another day. Let's bless him for another opportunity to gather at his feet this morning. Let's thank him. Let's worship him because it has pleased the Lord that we see this day. Not many started this year with us. Not many 
Many that started this year with us are nowhere to be found right now. Is it that we are holier than they? No. Let's worship the name of the Lord because we are here again, strong, ill and hearty. We can move every part of our body. Um, Christians, many Christians, all we do is ask, ask, ask and ask. We forget to thank God for the things we feel that are too little. We feel they are too little. <laughs> Why should I? It's a normal thing. It's a normal thing that happens in life. No. If we go to the hospital, we'll see a lot of, you know, people there. And when we come out, you say, ah, God, I thank you. I thank you for life. That I can lift my leg. That I can fart. That I can go to the bathroom. Hmm. Many people are paying to fart. Many people are paying to poop. We all know that. Let's worship the name of the Lord. Let's thank him for everything he is to us. Thanks, thanks. We give you thanks for all you have done in our lives. We are so blessed. Our soul has found rest. Oh Lord, we give you thanks. Sing thanks to the Lord. Thanks, thanks. We give you thanks. Oh, oh for all you. Done in our lives, we are so blessed. We are so blessed. Our soul has found rest. Oh Lord, we give you thanks. Oh, thanks, thanks. We. Thanks for all you have done in our lives. We are so blessed. Our soul has found rest. Oh, Lord, we give you thanks lord we give you thanks 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 we give you thanks for all you have done in our lives we are so blessed our soul has found rest. Oh, Lord, we give you thanks. The steadfast love of the Lord never ceases. His mercy is never come to an end they are new they are new every morning new every morning great is thy faithfulness oh lord great is thy faithfulness the steadfast the bible says where two or three are gathered the lord is in our midst let's sing out like we mean it let's appreciate god this morning oh his mercy is never come to an end. Day are new, day are new. Every morning, always new. Every morning, 
Great is thy faithfulness, O Lord. Great is thy faithfulness. You've got times and seasons in your hands oh you call for light out of darkness you don't need a man to be the god you are you have chosen to call me your own you've got times and seasons in your hands you called for light out of darkness you don't need a man to be the God you are, you have chosen to call me your. You are God, you are God, from beginning to the end. There's no place for argument. You are God all by yourself. You are God. You are God. From beginning to the end. There's no place for argument. You are God all by yourself. You've got times. You've got times and seasons in your hands you called for light you called for light out of darkness you don't need a man to be the god you are you have chosen to call me your own you are God you are God from beginning to the end there's no place for argument you are God all by yourself you are God There's no place for argument. You are God all by yourself. No one can see the end of your grace. Oh, no one can see the end of your love. No one can see the end of your power. No one can see the end of your love. Oh, as high as the heavens, as high as the heavens stands, stands above the earth. You are exalted. You are exalted. Exalted, you are exalted, you are exalted, you are exalted, unlimited God, you are exalted, you 
are exalted. You are exalted. You are exalted. Unlimited God. Generation after generations keep praising you. Yet no one sums you up. Then I ask the Lord, what name fits you? And he said, yeah. Generations after generations keep praising you. Yet no one serves you. Then I ask the Lord, then I ask the Lord, what name fits you? And he said, Yeah, generations, generations after generations. Keep praising you, keep praising you, yet no one sums you up. Then I ask the Lord, what name fits you? And he said, yeah, oh, yeah, the hallowed one. Yeah, the Holy One, Yahweh, the King of Zion. Oh, 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 yeah, the Hallowed One, yeah, the Holy One, Yahweh, the King of Zion. One more time, yeah, the hallowed one, yeah, the holy one, Yahweh, the King of Zion. Amen. Amen. So we are going to clap. We are going to dance. Are we ready? Yes, so. You are all ready, right? Okay, let's rise to our feet. Everlasting Father, everlasting Son, immortal Holy Ghost, be thou glorified. Everlasting Father, yes, come on. Everlasting Son, immortal Holy Ghost, be thou glorified. Everlasting Father. Everlasting Son, Immortal Holy Ghost, be thou glorified. Everlasting Father, Everlasting Son, Immortal Holy Ghost, be thou glorified. Everlasting Father, Everlasting Son, Immortal Holy Ghost, be thou glorified, everlasting Father, everlasting Son, immortal Holy Ghost, be thou glorified. Thank you, Jesus, the lover of my soul, Alpha and Omega, you are worthy to be praised. In all generations, there is no one like you. Alpha and Omega, you are worthy to be praised. Thank you, Jesus, the lover of my soul. Alpha and Omega, you are worthy to be praised. In all generations, there is no one like you. Alpha and Omega, you are worthy to be praised. Thank you, Jesus, the lover of my soul. Alpha and Omega, you are worthy to be praised. 
In all generations, there is no one like you. Alpha and Omega, you are worthy to be praised. Thank you. Thank you, Jesus, the lover of my soul. Alpha and Omega, you are worthy to be praised. In all generations, there is no one like you. Alpha and Omega, you are worthy to be praised. What a marvelous God, what a wonderful God, you have done marvelous things for me. What a marvelous God, what a beautiful, you still doing marvelous things for me. What a marvelous Hey, what a marvelous God, what a marvelous God, he's still doing marvelous things for me. What a marvelous God, what a wonderful God, he has done marvelous things for us. What a marvelous God, what a marvelous God. He's still doing marvelous things for me. What a marvelous God. What a marvelous God. He has done marvelous things for me. Oh, what a marvelous God. What a marvelous. He's still doing marvelous things for me. What a marvelous God, what a beautiful God, He has done marvelous things for me. What a marvelous God, what a wonderful, He's still doing marvelous things for me. What a marvelous God, what a marvelous God. He has done marvelous things for me. What a marvelous God. What a marvelous God. He's still doing marvelous things for me. Awesome God. Awesome God. Mighty God. Mighty God. Awesome God. Mighty God, Mighty God, we give you praise. Awesome God, Awesome God, we give you praise. Mighty God. Awesome God, awesome God, mighty God, mighty God, awesome God, awesome God, mighty God, mighty God, we give you praise, give you praise, awesome God. Mighty God, Mighty God, oh, you are I am lifted up. Awesome God, you are high, you are high, you are I am lifted up. Mighty God, oh, awesome God. Mighty God, Mighty God, we give you praise. We give you praise. Awesome God, Awesome God, we give you praise. We give you praise. Mighty God, Mighty God, oh, you are. 
Awesome God. You are high, you are high. You are lifted up. Mighty God. I'm standing on the rock that never fails. 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 What about you? I'm standing on the rock that never fails. Oh, I'm standing on the rock that never fails. I'm standing on the rock that never, never fails. I'm standing on the rock that never fails. Verily, verily, you are good. Verily, verily, you are good. Verily, verily, you are good. Jesus, you are good. Verily, verily, you are good. Verily, verily, you are good. Verily, verily, you are good. Jesus, you are good. Jesus, you are good. Jesus, Jesus, you are kind. Jesus, you are good. Jesus, you are good. Sing sweet Jesus. Oh, Jesus, Jesus, how I love, how I love, calling your name. Oh, Jesus, Jesus, wonderful Jesus, Jesus, every day, every day. Your name is the same. Oh, Jesus. Jesus. Sing sweet Jesus. Jesus. How I love. How I love. Calling your name. Oh, my Jesus. The lily of the valley, Jesus, every day, every day, your name is the same. How I love, how I love, calling your name every day, every day. same how I love how I love calling calling your name every day your name your name is the same we bow down and walk Yahweh, we bow down to Yahweh, we bow down and worship Yahweh, Yahweh. your name 
We lift your name. We lift your name. We lift your name. We lift your name. Oh, we lift your name. We lift your name. Shout Alleluia. Alleluia. Shout Alleluia. Shout Alleluia. Shout Alleluia. Shout Alleluia. your name Glory. 
glorious name, that wonderful name. Jesus, hallelujah, that wonderful name, Jesus, that wonderful name, Jesus, there is no Let us go before the Lord. Let us magnify that wonderful name. At this season in our lives as believers, let us praise the name of Jesus. Let us thank him. Let us magnify his name. Let us thank him for the cross. Let us thank him for the blood. Let us worship him. Let us give him praise. Let us give him praise. If not for him, where would we be? Father, we thank you. Father, we honor you. We praise your holy name. We like unto you, O Lord. Father, we worship you. We magnify your holy name. We give you praise. We give you praise. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you for the cross. Thank you for giving us lives. Thank you, O Lord. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord, for who you are. Thank you for your love. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, King of Kings. Thank you, Lord of Lord. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord. Emmanuel. Glory to your name. Emmanuel. Honor to your honor to your name, Emmanuel, Emmanuel. Glory to your name, glory to your name, Emmanuel. Honor to your name, in Jesus' name we have worship. We are still going to go and thank God for how far he's been with us since the beginning of the year, especially since the beginning of this 50 hours program, since Thursday. Ah, Lord, we thank you. Lord, we thank you. Father, we bless your holy name for testimonies that is abounding. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord. Father, we thank you for loving us, for great and mighty things. Father, we bless your holy name. Father, thank you. We worship your holy name. For in Jesus' name, we have given thanks. <clears throat> this session, we are going to focus on positive change. We want to start by looking at the, our, our Bible text from the book of Exodus, chapter 14, verse 19. And the angel of God, which went before the camp of Israel, removed and went behind them. And the pillar of the cloud went from before their face and stood behind them. Then I go to verse 22, which says, And the children of Israel went into the midst of the sea upon the dry ground, and the waters were a wall unto them, and their right hand and on their left hand. Praise the Lord. We want everybody needs change. <clears throat> there are changes and there are changes, but we want to focus. What we want as children of God is positive, positive change. <clears throat> Let us go before him. Our first prayer point is, Father, we acknowledge you as the almighty, the unchangeable changer. You are the unchangeable changer. Our Father, you are the only one that cannot be changed, but you are the ones who make changes in our lives. Father, Lord, we come before you. You are the Almighty God. There is no one else but you. Father, you are the unchangeable changer. Father, Lord, we come before you. 
that all things that are not from you, Father, turn them around in our favor this morning. Ah, Father, turn them around. Turn them around. Turn them around in our favor, in the mighty name of Jesus. Father, turn them around. You are the unchangeable changer. Father, Lord, all changes come from you. Ah, Father, Lord, change us into your favor in the name of Jesus. Change us, remodel us like you want us to be. Father, change us, Lord, and we shall be changed in the mighty name of Jesus. In Jesus' name we have prayed. Amen. We all know we are, we, are, we are before the salvation of our souls. In the book of Isaiah chapter 12, verse 3, which says, Therefore with joy shall ye draw water out of the wells of salvation. Let us thank God for positive changes that salvation has brought upon our lives and, the, and upon our destinies in the name of Jesus. Father, we thank you for saving our souls, for counting us worthy. Thank you, thank you, thank you for the changes that our salvation has brought into our lives. In the mighty name of Jesus, thank you for positive change. If we look back where we are, uh, before we met, before the Lord himself changed us on his side, before we came to the camp of Jesus, uh, Father, Lord, it has, if it has not been for you, where would we be? Some of us will not even be alive. Ah, Father, because of your salvation, you saved us, you redeem us. Ah, Father, Lord, you draw us to your side. Thank you, Father. Thank you, King of Kings. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord. For in Jesus' name, we have given thanks. We're going to say, Father, we thank you for reigning in the affairs of all our nation at all times. Ah, Baba. We thank you, Lord, for reigning in the affairs of our nation. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord. Thank you for reigning in our lives. Thank you for reigning in the affairs of na nations. In the name of Jesus. Thank you, O Lord. Thank you, O Lord. Thank you, O Lord, for reigning in the affairs of, our, of nations. In, at all times, in the name of Jesus, you never get tired of us. Father, you continuously make changes in our lives, in our nation. Father, we thank you. Father, we worship you. For in Jesus' name, we have prayed. Before we go further, let us even think, what are positive changes? What came to my mind is the story of uh, Esther. You know where Esther was, an orphan, a slave, and you saw how she started. But through the love of God, through, through the intervention of God, he, she became a queen because she obtained grace and favor. That is why we are, are going to ask our God that that same kind of positive change we want in our lives. Our Father, Lord, let us obtain grace and favor. Like, like, like you endowed Esther with. Father, in the name of Jesus. Ah, Father, Lord, in the mighty name of Jesus. Favor us. Favor us, O oh Lord. Favor us, O oh Lord. Ah, Father, we, are, want to, uh, we obtain grace and favor. Father, favor us. Favor us. Favor us. Turn like, things around in a positive way for us. In the mighty name of Jesus. Father, turn things around. Turn things around for us. In the mighty name of Jesus. Turn things around for us. Let our change come. In the name of Jesus. And it shall be for your glory and your glory alone. Father, make changes in our lives. Make changes in our lives. For in Jesus' name we have prayed. Our God is so good. We see all many, there are many uh, 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 promises that he has given unto us. If we look at the book of Jeremiah 29, 11, for I know the thoughts that I think towards you, says the Lord, thought of peace and of good ah, and not of evil to give you an expected hand. 
This is his promise to us. <clears throat> this is the promise of God to us. You know, if we don't know who we are in him, that is why some of us are not performing to our potentials. We want to ask God, and God does not change. He is the one that changes, that can change us, but he himself is unchangeable. He never lies. This is his promise. He's ready for us. It's up to us. Ah, first, let us go before him. Let us ask God that, we, that which will make us change and be obedient children unto him, that will make us excel in every way that God will give unto us. In the mighty name of Jesus, Father, Lord, you have good thoughts for us. Father, you have good thoughts for us, Lord. Ah, Father, Lord, help us. Help us. We have come to you this morning. Help us, Lord. Help us, Lord. Help us, Lord. We thank you for being our help in ages past and our hope for years to come. Father, you are our hope. You are our hope. You are our hope. You are our hope. We thank you for your help in, uh, in ages past and our, year, and our hope for years to come. Father, Lord, help us. Father, Lord, help us. We are looking up to you. Ah, Father, Lord, we have no power of our own. We humble ourselves before you. Ah, we have no power of our own. I have no power of my own. Holy Spirit, I look unto you. Help me, for I have no power of our own. Ah, Oluwa, we have no power of our own. We humble ourselves before you. Father, help us. You have been our help in ages past, and you are our hope for years to come. Father, help us. Let there be positive change in all areas of our lives. Ah, Father, let there be positive change in our spiritual life. Let there be positive change in our marital lives. Let there be positive change in our physical life. Let there be positive change in our finances. Every area of our lives, Father, we ah, Father, we ask for your favor. We ask that you will change us in your ways. In Jesus' name we pray. We are going to pray, Father, the wind that is blowing, let it blow in my favor. In the mighty name of Jesus, Father, the wind that is blowing, let it blow in my favor. Father, in the name of Jesus, let it blow in, blow in my favor. In the mighty name of Jesus, let it blow in my favor. In Jesus' name we have prayed. We want God, we have said it, we have established it, that he never changes. It is us. We're going to ask God to deliver us from errors or error and sins that will set us against Jesus. In the name of Jesus. If we look at Numbers 11, 1, and when the people complained, it displeased the Lord. And the Lord heard it, and his anger was kindled, and the fire of the Lord burnt among them, and consumed them that were in the uttermost parts of the camp. We're going to ask God that every way, that what we are doing, that is displeasing to God, that God will take it away. In the mighty name of Jesus. Ah, Father, deliver us from errors, from sins. Ah, Father, deliver me. Deliver me, O oh Lord. Deliver us this morning. Deliver us, O oh Lord, from every sin of, of believing, every sin of murmuring. In the mighty name of Jesus, deliver us. Deliver us, O oh Lord. 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 In the mighty name of Jesus, all our unbelief, all our murmuring, all our complaints, ah, Father, deliver us. Deliver us so that our positive change will come. In the mighty name of Jesus, in Jesus' name we have prayed. In the book of Exodus 
chapter 14, that we started with verse 13, said, And Moses said unto the people, Fear ye not, stand still, and see the salvation of the Lord, which he will show to you today. For the Egyptians, which you, uh, you have seen before you will see them, you shall see them no more. Ah, that shall be our testimony. Father, Lord, help us to be still. Ah, Father, let, us, let, let your grace abound for us. In the name of Jesus, give us the grace to be still in the, in the presence of storm. In the mighty name of Jesus. He said he will always be with us. He didn't say because we are following him, there will not be storm. There will be storm. But what we need is the grace to be stand and to stay focused on Jesus. Ah, Father, let that be our portion. Let that be our testimony in the mighty name of Jesus. Father, as your wind blows, let your pillar blindfold my enemies from seeing and gaining access into my domain in the mighty name of Jesus. Father, Lord, as your wind of change is blowing, Father, let your pillar blindfold my enemies from sin and gaining access into, the do into my domain. In the mighty name of Jesus. Father, help us. Help us, O oh Lord. Blindfold our enemies. Blindfold our enemies. In the mighty name of Jesus. In Jesus' name we have prayed. We're going to ask God that, Father, we ask for pillars of protection for all our members against the onslaught of terrorists and kidnappers in our nation. We all heard what just happened in Baltimore a few days ago. You know, some people would have been there. I'm sure there will be people who will testify that, ah, I was supposed to be at work that day or I was supposed to be. But they were, it was only God. We are going to ask ourselves, we are going to ask God we're going to leave all our ways into his hands. That where there, are go there is going to be disaster, where there is going to be accident, he will shield us. He has always been our shield. He has always been our guide. Any sort of terrorism, any sort of uh, uh, evil things that may be going around us, our Father, Lord, protect us. Shield us, O oh Lord. Shield us, O oh Lord. Father, shield us. Father, shield us. Father, shield us. In the name of Jesus. Father, because the wind is blowing, make ways for us where there had been no ways. In the mighty name of Jesus. Our Father, Lord, you protected the Israelites. You made a way. Our Father, Lord, in the Red Sea. You have never changed. You are still the same God. Father, protect us. Protect us, O oh Lord. Wherever we find ourselves, wherever our children find themselves, in their school, in their job, anywhere, Father, our ah, Lord, protect us. We are always under your wings. Father, protect us in the mighty name of Jesus. Father, keep us safe. Keep us safe. Keep us safe, O oh Lord. We have nowhere else to turn to but unto you. Father, Lord, <clears throat> protect us. Protect us and keep us safe. In the mighty name of Jesus. Ah, the wind is blowing. Let the wind make way for us wherever we are. Father, Lord, let your wind, let, let your wind blow us into your direction. In the mighty name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus, in Jesus' name we have prayed. You know, we want changes. We're going to ask God, as the wind is blowing, connect us to opportunities in the name of Jesus. Ah, connect us, O oh Lord. Connect us to opportunities. Ah, we are what we are blind into. Father, open our eyes. Open our eyes in the mighty name of Jesus. Open our eyes, Olua. Open our eyes. Father, open our eyes. Father, open our eyes, O Lord. Open our eyes. In the mighty name of Jesus. In the glorious name of Jesus. Father, open our eyes. 
Ah, we want to see you. Father, Lord, open our eyes. In the mighty name of Jesus. In the book of Genesis, chapter 21, verse 19, we see what happened here. We know we're all familiar with the story of Hagar. And God opened her eyes, and she saw a well of water. And she went and filled the bottle with water and gave the lad drink. You know, the lad, that the child that would have been dead, but God opened uh, uh, the mother's eyes to see where the water, water is. We're going to ask God, Father, in the name of Jesus, open my eyes to see and my ears to hear opportunity for growth and improvement in my life. In the name of Jesus, Father, open my eyes to see. Open my eyes to see. Open my ears to hear where opportunities are for growth and improvement in my spiritual life. Ah, Father, Lord, in my career life, in our academic life, in our marital lives, all areas of our lives. Father, open our eyes, open our ears for opportunity of growth. Ah, Father, we, want, we don't want to be stagnant. Father, open my eyes, open my eyes to see, connect us from the east, from the west, from the south, from the north. Ah, Father, Lord, let nations, let organizations rise up unto us in the mighty name of Jesus. Ah, let uh, nations rise up unto us. Let organizations rise up unto us in the name of Jesus. Let the heavens be open on our behalf. Father, let the heavens be open. Let the heavens be opened in the mighty name of Jesus. Father, help us, O oh Lord. Ah, help us, help us, help us. Father, help us. Father, help us. Father, help us. In the name of Jesus. Father, give me the courage and the capacity to make the adjustment needed to move me to the next level. We want to move to the next level. We want to move to the next level. Father, encourage us. Give us the courage. Give me the courage. Give me the courage and the capacity to make adjustment that is needed in my life to move me to the next level. I'm tired of staying on this level. Father, move me forward. Ah, you are the greatest changer. You are the only one that can do it. Father, help me. Father, help me. Connect us to opportunities in the mighty name of Jesus. Ah, Father, help me. Help me, help me, help me. Help me, O oh Lord. Help me, O oh Lord. Help me, O oh Lord. Father, help me. Almighty God, please help me. Help us, O oh Lord. Open our eyes. Open our eyes. Open our eyes so that we will know where you want us to go. So that you will lead us aright. In the mighty name of Jesus. Open my eyes, open my ears to hear you. Father, help me. Ah, Father, help me. Father, help me. Help me, O oh Lord. You are the helper of the helpless. Ah, Father, I declare I'm helpless. Father, help me. Help me, Lord. Help me, Lord. Help me, Lord. Help me, Lord. In the mighty name of Jesus. Father, help me. Almighty God, please help me. Father, help me. Ah, connect us, Lord. To connect us. Father, connect us. In our spiritual life, connect us. We want to move forward. Move on to the next level. Move New Wine Assembly to the next level. Father, we thank you. Because we are New Wine was last year. It's not where New Wine is to this year. Thank you. Where we were 20 years ago, it's not where we are now. Father, thank you for moving us forward. Thank you, Lord, because we continually bring positive changes into our lives. In the name of Jesus. In Jesus' name we have prayed. We're going to say, Father, give us the art of gratitude to always remember 
your past miracles in the face of current difficulties in the mighty name of Jesus. Father, give us the heart of gratitude. Give us the heart of gratitude to always remember your past miracles in the, in the, in the face of the current challenges in the mighty name of Jesus. Ah, Father, we thank you. Father, we're going to pray, Father, as the wind is blowing, ground to all, ground to all, all the chariots of the wicked pursuers of our destinies in the mighty name of Jesus. Father, as the wind is blowing, ah, Father, ground to, uh, to all, halt, ground halt to all chariots of the wicked pursuers of our destinies. In the mighty name of Jesus. In Jesus' name we have prayed. We are going to ask God that, Father, as your wind is blowing in my favor, I shall sing for joy throughout this year and years to come. In the mighty name of Jesus. Father, as your wind of changes is blowing, Father, Lord, ah, I will sing for joy throughout this year. I will sing for joy throughout my life. In the mighty name of Jesus. Our Father, Lord, Moses sang. In the book of Exodus chapter 15 verse 1, said then sang Moses and the children of, of Israel this song unto the Lord. And spake, saying, I will sing God to the Lord, for he has triumphed gloriously the horse and his rider as his thrown into the sea. We sing unto the Lord, that he has triumphed gloriously the horse and his rider has been thrown into the sea. I will sing unto the Lord, for he has triumphed gloriously, the horses and his rider has been thrown into the sea. That shall be our song for the rest of the year and for the rest of our lives. In the mighty name of Jesus. Ah, Father, for sure the wind will blow in my favor. The wind will blow in the favor of New Wine Assembly. In the mighty name of Jesus. Ah, the wind of favor will blow in, in our, uh, on our behalf. In the name of Jesus. And we shall all sing a joyful song. In the mighty name of Jesus. In Jesus' name we have prayed. Eternal King of glory. Our Lord, our Father, our Redeemer. The unchangeable changer. Here we are looking up to you this morning. Father, Lord, our Father, we ask in our humility, in all humility, that you will bring positive changes into our lives. Every area of our life that has been stagnant, Baba, you will bring positive changes. Father, you will move us forward in all areas of life. You will move New Wine Assembly forward. You will move our pastor forward. You will move all ministers forward. You will move all workers forward. Everyone connected to New Wine Assembly shall be moved forward. In the mighty name of Jesus. And we shall all sing a new song. In Jesus' name we have prayed. Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. Um, this morning we are going to pray on dreams and uh, visions. That's our prayer uh, focus this morning. And, uh, you know, when the thing was given to me, I've already studied, but I said, ah, is it there? I said, okay. It's, I think it's, it's, it's good to pray for dreams and visions because dream is very, very important. And I'm very sorry for some people. They say they don't dream. It's very, very dangerous if you don't dream. Okay, that's the work of the, of the devil. So, and for people that think that, oh, you don't dream, wherever you are, you pray that you dream and you see visions so that your life will be much better than where you are right now. In the name of Jesus. So, 
uh, our test is, I will only read uh, two of it because of our time. Genesis chapter 37, verse 8. And his brethren shall, and his brethren shall reign over us. They were asking, it was Joseph that, brother, they were asking from him. Shall thou, uh, okay, shall, shall thou reign over us? They were just asking, okay? And oh, oh, I want someone to read it for me, please. Genesis 37, verse 8. Can somebody read it for me, please? Yes, sir. Thank you, sir. So you see now, it was when Joseph had the dream, so he went to tell his, uh, his brethren. So they are now telling him that, uh, oh, you, you, you mean you want to reign over us or you want to have dominion over us, you know, and they hated him the more, okay? So, and Matthew 13, 25, I want somebody to read it for some people that say that they don't dream, dream. 1325. 1325. Yes, sir. You see now. So, for those people that say that they don't do dream, did the work of the of the enemy. So, and I know that uh, today we have a change of attitude and a change of mind. In Jesus' name. So I want us first of all to thank God for exposing. Mm, no, before then, I want you to thank God because in this place, the anointing and the presence of God is everywhere. So I want you to begin to thank God for that. That even our, our presence for, since Thursday to this time is not in vain. So I have that assurance that we have faith wherever you are that you share testimony. I want us to begin to bless God. Let me thank you for your presence in this place. We thank you for anointing this place. We thank you. We thank you. Our gathering is not in vain. We give all the glory. We give all the adoration. Blessed be your name in the name of Jesus. Thank you, Father. In Jesus' name, we are praying. You know, as we have prayed, and I want you to thank God for exposing the kingdom of darkness to us through dreams in Jesus' name. I want you to pray. Pray, but I say that thank you. I thank you. Because if we don't have the experience of it, we don't, we don't know how to thank God for that. I want to thank God for exposing the kingdom of darkness through dream to you. Daddy, I thank 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 you. There are some there are plots of the enemy that the Lord has exposed to you in your dream, and the Lord has helped you out. Why not say thank you? Daddy, I thank you. 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 I give all the glory. I give all the adoration. Blessed be your name. Thank you, Father. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord. Let me tell you something. I want to thank God for this. You know, when I first of all joined the prayer uh, ministry, prayer group, so I just be seeing wild animals, a lion, you know, those animals that can kill somebody. And at times, they'd be shooting me gun in the mouth because of the prayer ministry. So, you know what? Because they have taught us in the universe class that whenever you see such a thing, you have to pray. So, and you know what I did? Whenever they come, I always call the blood of Jesus. And that was the end of the oh, oh. So, as you that, uh, you know, as you that, there was no exposition. They just already slept and not wake up. They don't know that there may be some things have gone wrong. In the, so I want you also to think deeply and give thanks to God for exposing the kingdom of darkness in your life. Maybe the enemy has to matter. We will consume you right now. You don't even know. Say, Daddy, I thank you. 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 I want us to thank God again. Thank God for directing us through dreams to frustrate the plan of the enemy. You see now. 
Is that another thing you need to thank God for? Tell them, thank you. I thank you. I thank you. I thank you. I thank you for directing us. Thank you. Thank you to frustrate the plan of the enemy concerning our life. That we give you praise. That we thank you. That we thank you. That we thank you. That we thank you. We give all the glory. Give all the adoration. Blessed be your name. Thank you, Lord, my Father. Thank you, Lord, my Maker. Be worshipful. Blessed be your name. In Jesus' name, we are praying. We are going to pray that, Father, show me in the dream the secret of continual success in my life, in Jesus' name. Because in the book of Deuteronomy 29, 29, that the secret things belong to, to our God. But the word that is revealed to us, they are what? They are for us. So that's why you need to pray to God. That God should, should, should show you in your dream the secret of continuous success. You begin to pray, pray, pray that God should show you wherever you are right now. Even don't stay, you are going to the next level. But you need to pray about it. That Father, in my dream, show me in the name of Jesus the, the, my, the continuous success of my life. In the name of Jesus, you have not reached anything. You have not, you have not reached the peak of your life. You still need to move forward. So you need to pray. God has so many things to do for you. So I want you to pray in the name of Jesus, Father. Show me in the, in the secret of continuous success in my life. In the name of Jesus Christ. Father, show me in the name of Jesus. The secret of my success in the name of Jesus. Continuous one. Continuous, continuous, continuous. In the name of Jesus. Father, show me in my dream in the name of Jesus. That is why when you want to sleep, eh, don't just rush to bed just like that. Pray to God, Father, I want to go and sleep. Father, show me the secret in my dream. Okay? So thank God like that, that Father. In the name of every night, when you want to go and sleep, you need to pray like that. And you see what God is going to do for you in the name of Jesus. I want you to pray that, Father, forsake any form of dream manipulation in my life. In the name of our Lord Jesus Christ. You know, because in the, in the, at times they man, in, in the dream, they might show you negativity. Eh? But because of the word of God, because in the book of uh, Lamentation chapter 3 verse 37, he said that, uh, that who, who, who speaketh that came to, came to pass when God commanded not. So that is why we are going to begin to, to frustrate every, every negativity, every negative dream in your life. In the name of our Lord Jesus Christ, I want you to begin to pray that Father, frustrate any form of dream manipulation in my life. In the name of our Lord Jesus Christ, thank you, Father. I want you to pray. Our Father, any evil dream in my life will never manifest in Jesus' name. You need to pray like that, okay? Because some people, they have dream. They just leave it like that. You know it's not good. You need to be able to pray. Maybe you have evil dream overnight. I want you to pray right now. That, that evil dream that you dream will not manifest. It will not manifest. It will not manifest. It will not manifest. It will not manifest. Bad dream. No manifest in my name of Jesus. You don't manifest in the name of Jesus. Every bad dream, bad dream, bad vision in the name of Jesus. You don't manifest. Concerning this church, concerning our life, concerning the children, you don't manifest. You don't manifest. You don't manifest. You don't manifest. Because the God said, Who speak? Well, as it came to pass, when the Lord had not commanded it, Father, in the name of Jesus, in every evil dream, you are not manifest. 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 I can't I can't every bad dream. In the name of Jesus, I can't I can't see. Concerning this nation, concerning this church, concerning the children, concerning men, concerning women, we can't see. 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 In the name of Jesus. In Jesus' name, we are praying. Do you know why you need to can't see? If you remember, uh, Joseph, when he was in the prison, no, he had an uh, interpretation of view for two people. So the other person did not do anything about it. So that's why the head was cut off. Uh, yes, if, if, maybe if you assume that, because the Bible said that whatever is written in the Bible is for what? Our own uh, admonition. So that is why I said that uh, you, you need to begin to cancel every, if you don't wait, okay? So, the thing, the thing will not, so every evil dream concerning me, concerning my life, concerning uh, the member of this church, 
we can't sue it. We can't sue it. Concerning your business, we can't sue it. 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 No manifest. No manifest. In Jesus' name, we are praying. Okay. Father, I forsake any attack in the dream by the blood of Jesus. You know, I, you know, you know the story I told you before that by the blood. Because the Bible said that we overcame the devil by the blood of Jesus and by the word of our testimony. There is power in the blood of the Lamb. There is power. There is power. There is power. There is power. There is power in the blood. There is power. There is power, there is power in the blood. There is power, there is power, there is power in the blood. Power, there is power, there is power in the blood. There is power, there is power, there is power in the blood. Power, there is power, there is power in the blood. You know, there is power in the blood of Jesus. If you don't experience it, you don't know. That there is power in the blood. So I want you to pray that for any attack in the dream, Father, I conquer you by the blood in the name of Jesus. By the blood, by the blood, by the blood, by the blood. Even the one that you had overnight right now, be need to cast you by the blood of the Lamb in the name of Jesus. Thank you, Father. Because the evil can never, never receive the blood. Thank you, Father. In Jesus' name, we are praying. I want us to pray that, Father, any power that feed me in the dream, the dream to poison me, shall be destroyed. In the, it's destroyed in the name of our Lord Jesus Christ. You know some people, they, they will give them food in the dream, and they think that maybe that is a party. You know, party, okay? So they, they don't want to poison you, or they want to defy you. And the Bible says that if you drink any deadly poison, it shall not hurt you. So that's why we have to know. The word of God. So I want you to pray. In the name of Job, you to destroy any power that feeds you in the dream that you destroy it. Destroy it. Destroy it. Destroy it. Be destroyed. Be destroyed. You shall eat any person. It shall not hurt you. Pray to God in the name of Jesus. Maybe you had dreamed overnight and they gave you food or drink in, the, in your dream. I decree right now that, that that thing will not manifest in the name of Jesus. The deadly person is not, not, not manifesting in your life. You are not hurt you. You are not hurt you. You can Matthew 16, 18 says so, that you did look at any deadly person. And not, that one of the signs that you are a believer. You are not hurt you. 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 In the name of Jesus. I want, I want, I want to, to defy you by giving food in the dream. You are not come to pass. You are not succeed. In the name of Jesus. Thank you, Father. I want you to pray that, Father, any arrow of affliction and forgotten dreams fire into my life. In the name of Jesus, be paralyzed and set ablaze. Do you know that? That's one of the things you to pray for, too. Because some people, they will dream and they forget. And very dangerous. So not some people at times. I said, ah, I said, Father, why that? So, now I want to go and sleep. I said, Father, I want to sleep. Please, any dream that I will dream today, let me remember. Because what you remember, you can tackle. And when you don't remember, it's gone. So that's why it's necessary to pray. Okay? The Father, in the name of Jesus. I never forget my dream. In the name of Jesus. I never forget my dream. 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 In the name of Jesus, I never forget my dream. In the name of Jesus, I never forget my dream. In the name of Jesus, when you remember, you know what to do about it. In the name of Jesus, I never forget my dream. In Jesus' name, we are praying. Let me give you just one scenario about this, this particular, about 20 something years ago. You know, in, 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 in okay, Nigeria. So, and uh, in the December of that year, I had a dream about mass uh, transfer of school. <laughs> and I woke up in the night. You know, I, I pray. I can't see it. Probably in January of that year, when I got to school, I said, everybody, they said, ah, it's on our day. Eh? They are just married people. You know, but I don't say anything. I kept it to myself because God has already shown me. So, they said that 
We even went to the headquarters, and we saw that your name, that they cast you there, that did not transfer you. That <laughs> so, so they now said, they now said that, I, that, that that's how you always behave, that you will not tell, any, tell, tell people anything, that you will be keeping it to yourself. That maybe even, the, at times they think that maybe it's my husband that went to the headquarters to go and cancel the... <laughs> So that's why it's necessary. So I said, ah, so that's why, as believer, you have you have an uh, advantage. Yes, if, if if you can remember your dream and even you dream dream. So I want you to pray in the name of Jesus. I'm not gonna forget my dream in the name of Jesus. Because when you have any dream, it did not wake up and pray and cancel. And even if it, the dream is even good too, so you need to pray about it so that you come to manifestation in the name of Jesus. Jesus, thank you, Father. Blessed be your name. In Jesus' name, we are praying. We are going to pray that Father, deliver me from negative dream that cause pain and weeping. In the name of Jesus, pray, pray. Deliver me from negative dream that cause me pain. In the name of Jesus, weeping. Deliver me. Deliver me. Deliver me. Deliver me. Deliver every member of this church. In the name of Jesus, deliver us from every, every, every negative dream that causes us pain. Father, deliver us. 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 In the name of Jesus. Deliver us. Deliver us. Deliver us. Deliver us. Deliver us. In the name of Jesus. Thank you, Father. In Jesus' name, we are praying. Holy Spirit, empower us with the gift of interpretation of dream. In the name of Jesus, let's pray. You will want it so that when you dream, you will be able to interpret it, uh, Father. Because you are the one that dreamed that dream. If you take it to another person, well, uh, that person has the interpretation can to can help you. But I want you to pray for yourself because it's for you, Father. In the name of Jesus, Father, Holy Spirit. Holy Spirit, empower us, empower us in the, with the gift of interpretation of dream in the name of Jesus. Father, Lord, empower us. It's an empowerment. Father, empower us. The Holy Spirit that can help you, empower me. Empower me. I need it, O oh Lord. Empower me. Empower me. Empower me with the gift of interpretation of dream in the name of Jesus. Father, Father empower me. Empower me. Empower me. Empower me. Empower me, empower me, empower me, empower me, empower me, empower me. And that is why we need to study the word of God. That's where we can get it. Because at times we see some people in the internet, they say, oh, they say, uh, how to interpret dream. Oh, how to do this. I say, ah, what's wrong with my Bible? You know, you go to your Bible so that you will pray and God will help you. So there's not everything. That's in that Bible, everything in the Bible. There's nothing we want there that is not with there. If I read Bible about uh, maybe something happened and I was so angry. I said, okay, I said, this lady that cheated me, that I'm going to put cause on her. So you know what? I was now reading my Bible, with the book of uh, Romans. Now I wrote it there that that's another cause. <laughs> You know, I said, okay, I said, Daddy, I said, I said, Daddy, thank you. I said, Daddy, thank you. I said, I said no more calls. If I want to talk about it or speak, I said, mm-mm. That's, that's what I said, okay, okay. So that's why Bible is very, very good. It's we talk to you directly. Because the time I was reading, I didn't know that I'd go to be like that. When I, I said, ah, I will this to your back. I said, ah, my sister, I said, ah. I said, okay, I will not do it. So that's why you need to read your Bible. Okay, read it. If you are not start, just read, God was just reading it to help you. So, Holy Spirit, empower us with the gift of interpretation of dream in the name of our Lord Jesus Christ. Daddy, thank you. In Jesus' name, we are praying. I am going to the Lord. I decree that I will not die before the fulfillment and the torment of my dream in the name of Jesus Christ. You see, you see what you see what happened to. With Joseph, he did not die in the Potiphar's house. He did not die in the prison. So, so the same thing can happen to you too. So, you will not die before the fulfillment of your dream. 
I brought your enthronement. Is that because you are going to be enthroned in the name of Jesus? Not die in the name of Jesus before the fulfillment of your dream in the name of Jesus. You not work for another person to eat in the name of our Lord Jesus Christ. You not labor in vain in the name of Jesus. You not labor in vain in the name of Jesus. I'm not labor in vain. In the name, I'm not work for another person to eat in the name of our Lord Jesus Christ. I'm not die before the manifestation, the fulfillment of my dream, and even that of the children that are given to me in the name of our Lord Jesus Christ. No, I've not died before my time. In the name of Jesus, I fulfill my destiny in the name of Jesus. I fulfill my dream in the name of Jesus. You know what? You need to pray because they say, eh, there's some people that, eh, that they, they have already finished building their house. So maybe the time they are supposed to, to move in. They die. That will never be your portion. In the name of our Lord Jesus Christ. Pray to God like that. Then I will not labor for another person to eat. In the name of Jesus. I will not labor for another person to eat. I will not die. Not the fulfillment of my dream. In the name of Jesus. I will not die. Not the fulfillment of my dream. In the name of Jesus. I will not say cable. In my ba 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 de 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 Let me tell you, tell you this uh, true story of one of uh, my, my friend. So we used to pray together in, in the school. So she, she has already about you know, to get a PhD. You know what? She does even taste it. She died I mean, before that time. So you know, the thing really pay every one of us. Ah, the person that was supposed to go, doctor, so, 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 go, Dr. Augusta. You know, even in the burial ground, that's what you know the better. Is it already? So I want us to pray that Father will not die before the fulfillment of my dream. In the name of Jesus, I will not die. I will not die. If the children you are given unto us, they will not die before the fulfillment of their dream. In the name of Jesus, you know what will waste their life. In the name of our Lord Jesus Christ, thank you, Lord Redeemer. Blessed be your name. In Jesus' name, we are praying. I want us to pray that Father, give it to me. In the dream of my greatness, and give me the grace to 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 stand until the manifestation. That is patience, you know. Because God might show you that oh, you'll be king tomorrow. You'll be thinking that oh, tomorrow the, 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 you'll be running up and down. You know that you have to be patient, you know, because there is a process. Is that the, in, in in camp, they told us one time that there was somebody. Maybe two of them they went to. The prophet and prophet to the world that he will be king. You know that you know that other one that nothing for that. Uh, I'm just paraphrasing. <laughs> so the person that uh, they told that taking the, the uh, so pleasure, but the person that they told that maybe you be you be a slave. Ah, you know that when well, my life I'm not be so. He quickly he quickly walk towards it. You are, you, are, you understand? So you started praying, 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 and be patient. No, I mean, but the one that was even greater than the other, other fellow. So you need to be patient and you need to pray about whatever your dream is about. And you need to be patient. Be patient. Be patient. Because some of us, we are not patient. So be patient. Where we are dealing with God. Because patience is also one of the gifts and one of the fruits of the, of, the, of the Spirit. So when they say, oh, we are going to be that, leave this, be praying to God. And be patient, and it surely come to pass in Jesus' name. So, Father, Father, Father as your wind is blowing, please give me the grace to understand all visions and dreams in Jesus' name. You know, when I, when I say, ah, I say, is it, when I say, oh, to understand all, I say, is it possible? I say, oh, 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 okay, I say, okay, Daniel, one second thing, because Daniel is, is also. A man like passion like yourself. So he, he does not have two, two heads. He's a person. So you too you can, you can understand all dreams and all visions. I want you to pray that, Father. It's a grace, Father, a little grace upon me in the name of Jesus. To understand, oh God, Father, all visions and dreams in the name of Jesus. So that, so that you not miss it in the name of the Lord Jesus Christ. Maseke poso ko bara baze gebo do goro bara baba nimba baba bare de 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 de
If as the wind is blowing, Father, you give us the grace, the grace to understand all visions and dreams. In the name of our Lord Jesus Christ. I want you to pray that God will open your eyes in the name of Jesus to see opportunity in the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus, God will open your eyes in the name of Jesus. God will open your eyes. God will give you a good dream. You will not forget your dream in the name of our Lord Jesus Christ. The power of God will come upon you mightily in the name of our Lord Jesus Christ. That Lord will thank you. Blessed be your name. I want us to pray because. That uh, maybe it's Pastor okay that prayed the prayer, I don't know. That pattern, okay? You know that something is running in your family. Quickly pray and cancel it in the name of every generation of course. You have for children here, we cancel it. We stand the gap. We cancel it. 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 But the power in the blood. The power in the blood. In the name of Jesus. Thank you, Father. Blessed be your name. In Jesus' name we are praying. He has conquered the womb. See what Jesus has done. He has broken the womb. 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 See what Jesus has done. He has broken the womb. 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 Ya bokunda yo, ya bokunda yo, ya bokunda, ya bokunda yo, ya bokunda, ya bokunda yo, ya bokunda yo. He has broken the yo. He has broken the yo. He has broken the yo. You know we pray prayer the last session before now. I said. This Saturday was supposed to be for the disciples a very miserable day. Because really, what happened was that before Jesus was already, they've been with Jesus, they were like, you know, heroes. They were like, you know, celebrations. Everybody was, I mean, envy in town. <laughs> you are connected to this high man. All of a sudden on Friday, the man was killed. Can you imagine what happened on Saturday? Some people that have been looking for their shame before say, see them. You see your life after three and a half years. Nothing. I don't think on that these days, Saturday, Peter will be able to go out because he was not sure of what he was going because as I saw, he was telling them, I need to go back for fishing. So he was not sure of his future. But do you know the future was intact because the Lord said to we are going to rise up on our faith. And say, Father, in the mighty name of Jesus, whatever, oh God, the enemy has stolen. Ha! Every area of my life, whatever the plan of enemy today disappear. Ah! Likata. Revive, oh God, my dream. Revive my dream, oh God. Bring a lie. Whatever that is dead, oh God, come alive. Zakabo Zorigebo. Whatever the enemy meant for evil, Lord, turn it around for my good. We are going to decree, let my star shine. In the name of the, I will not be cut short. My life will not be cut short. I will not go down in life. No reproach, no sorrow, no shame, no weeping over my life. No one will have a purpose to say sorry to me. In the name of the Lord, ah, for whatever, back whatever. My children will fulfill their destiny. Ah, every member of the one that we shall fulfill our destiny. In the name of the Lord. Ah, Shakatara Baya Baba. Holy in this resurrection, oh God. Lord, ah, we could go. Father, 
God, let it come alive. Whatever that is dead in me, come alive. Come alive. Every part of my body. Lord, restore my health, oh God. Restore, oh God, my dream. Revive me, oh God. Lift me up on every side. In the name, let it be well with me. In the name of the Lord. Yeah. Make me a blessing. Let me be fruitful, oh God. Everywhere that I go, oh God, let me win souls for you. In that, let me love you. Mother, strengthen me, oh God. Lord, to follow you, to obey you. I will not dis I will love you with all my heart, oh God. And I will please you, oh God. I will not be rebellious. I will not turn back. In the mighty name of Jesus, your grace shall be, oh God, be sufficient for me. In the name of Jesus, thank you, wonderful God. Glory and honor be unto you. In Jesus' name, we have prayed. Let us thank God for the joy of Easter. That today uh, is no longer in the grave. The grave is empty. He paid it. Let us thank him. Lord, we give you praise. Thank for what you have done for the finished work of Calvary. Glory be to your name. In Jesus' name, we are praying. Amen. Congratulations. Happy Easter again. Um, we are going to have a break now. And then we continue the prayer at 12 noon. God bless you.